people. Welcome back to a farmer place, Lord of the Rings Online. Today, we're going to going to be speaking to Master Elrond. This is Volume One, Book Twelve, Chapter One: A Strange Fate. I am concerned at it, as I am sure you are, by the capture of Amarthiel. Though she has been stripped of Narquil, she may, she may still pose some threat to the unwary. It is no small choice deciding the fate of Amarthiel, but there are other pressing matters. Strange news has come from my scouts in the south. I must concern myself with these things as well as others. And I have tasked none other. I have tasked none less than the elf lord Glorfindel with the matter of Amarthiel. See what counsel he can give you, and maybe you can offer him some aid in rendering his judgment. You may find Lord Glorfindel outside my house to the southeast. Right, so it's been five months. I think it's been six months since I recorded something, and five months since I posted something. Which, obviously, I thought that was supposed to be material. Well, anyway, uh, with my awesome memory, I remember totally what happened in the last book. Totally. Um, and it doesn't help that s since then I have listened to a couple of... Oh, yeah, it was to the south. I've listened to a couple of... Um, like, kind of broad overview storylines. Not storylines, like, this description of how this goes. So, like... Oh, did I do it? Oh, no, I listened to it. Oh, did I listen to it? Yeah. Anyway. There's a quest for Glorfindel's company. Oh, interesting. If I did this, it was a long time ago. It's 36 people. Glorfindel is here. I recommend Glorfindel is cool. That's a statement I do not... Uh, regret saying ever right the matter of Amarthiel is grave indeed it is a strange fate that Amarthiel or Narmeleth as she now wishes to be called is again imprisoned where she was once held so long ago she must be questioned and though Master Elrond has bidden me to address this matter at once I still have many other duties to which to attend I would ask you to go and speak with her perhaps you may glean some information of use for from a Marthiel. Edit, beware her words. This might again be some trickery on her part, though my heart counsels me that she speaks true. Right. So we're going back to the Losad, which is oh right, it's here. Well we're gonna find a staple master. What was this place called again? Candeleth. I got Candeleth. And yeah, it's just been, it's just been great. Well, here we are in the Losad. And um, yeah, this is going to be, I remember being here before, definitely. I actually do, that wasn't a uh, irony or anything of the sort. Right, let's speak to. Oh, I don't want to. I don't want a door. Um, I am surprised, Edit. I had not thought that you would be the one who would, who, who should choose to come and listen to a broken elf maiden's tale. I will automatically travel to Esteldin in the North Downs once I accept this. Interesting. Though few believe it, I have been freed from the evil that once ensnared me. It was the lifting of a veil and a release from a chain that held me for so long. I am no longer consumed by the ring Narquil, nor the desire for it. I have dire news, a warning for those that would listen. As a Marthiel, I had heard whispers of a hidden city of the Dunedain, Esteldin. I had sent out a master spy to divine its location and now by the and by now they surely must have located it. The the rangers must have must be warned of this threat. I apologize. Oof. 
If the spy is able to infiltrate a Steldin, they will move a large force against it in secret. Travel to the North Downs and warn the leader of this camp against the treachery that I have sown. Well, that was convenient. I like this. Was it in here? I think so. That's true. Halbarat. What brings you to Esteldin this day, he added? A spy among us here in Esteldin? It seems unlikely that a spy would be able to penetrate our ranks, and even less likely given the source of this information. If you insist upon pursuing the matter, go and speak with the refugees that were recently rescued from Angmar. Oh, yeah. okay, come on. That's, that's too obvious. Doubtless you will find that they are simple herdsmen and farmers. Speak with the refugees outside of the library near the craft hall, watching my kinsmen train and by the stable master, though I see little wisdom in trusting the words of the enemy at it. Well, that's true enough. That's definitely true enough. Mm -hmm. Rona says, I would not even know how to recognize what you see, Warden. I am but a simple farmer. I can relate. There's someone behind me. Let's check that out. Crafting hall? No, right next to it. Narn? I call it. Is it Narn? Narn. Narn? A spy? Friend, I have seen many things, but no spy. Tricky name, I think. Nairn? Nairn. Nairn sounds better, but not Narn. That's not cool. Sorry to all, everybody who's called Narn. Nairn is cooler. Oh. Maybe there is another one behind me. Maybe there was one in the crafting hall. Uh, Alice is missing. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe it did list all the locations. If I was a library, where would I hide? It's right in front of me, isn't it? Yeah, right in front of me. Oh, is this the library? Maybe it is. Eon says, I have seen nothing strange since I left Angmar Warden. Well, um, I saw something interesting. Of Arthurdain and its settlements. Oh, well, this is a quest. Well, we'll skip it. Interesting, though. Very interesting. One of the refugees is missing. Suspicious. Those whom we have taken under the protection here in Esteldin are not allowed to depart without my leave under penalty of death. This is the law and it has protected us and kept us hidden from our enemies. It is likely that this refugee is only returning to her homestead and that she is no spy, but she must still be brought to judgment for breaking the laws of Esteldin. Search the easternmost pass onto Angmar and bring back the refugee, be she spy or otherwise. Aye, that we can do. How awesome this must have been in 2007. To have been leveling, and then this is your entering into Angmar. Right. Right, so. Lay down your weapons and walk away, Warden. I will not be stopped. Oh. 
about that. Oh, I haven't actually fought as a warden in like forever. Well, I can muster an SL team. Alice was a spy. I am sorry for mistrusting your counsel, though doubtless even the wise would not have seen aid of this nature coming unlocked. I'm sorry, I have to read through this again. Uh, I got this part right, but I'll start all over again. Alice was a spy. I am sorry for mistrusting your counsel, though doubtless even the wise would not see aid of this nature coming unlocked from for unlocked for from such an ally. I am, my wits must be more cloudy than I thought. Well, I think maybe maybe we do this one as well, just since we're going to be automatic automatically traveling. Mm, then yes, this is good. Esteldin remains hidden, and though I am glad that disaster was averted, I am I am not so sure. She was literally at the gate with a lot of people around her. Anyway, I still do not wholly trust the counsel of Namarthiel, no, Narmeler, who for so long brought the strife and war upon us. She may still have a great store of information to offer our cause, so you may return to the Losat with my thanks. But be wary, I am not wholly convinced that she can be trusted in all matters, and that this is not some grand scheme of the enemy. I am glad that, that that at least one of my wicked deeds has been amended. There are so many others whose oh, there are so many others whose weight I must bear for the rest of my days, however few of those might be. Alright, now I'll tackle this next time. And then Yes, well, maybe I'm more sick than I thought, and this was a, well, I don't, I don't regret it, this was a good idea, but it's a bad idea to keep going. So, I thank you for the patience with of my cloudy thought, and, and I hope I will see you again in the next one, or in the one before, you don't have to watch this in order, or listen to it, or however you want, whatever you want, do as you want, I'm here for you, whatever you want, whatever you want.